Salut à tous, je m'appelle Thomas. Hello, I'm Anna. As you know, we are the editors of the EPA newsletter. Dans ce bulletin d'information, nous avons l'interview intéressant avec Alan Smith. Alan was awarded with the lifelong membership of EPA at the conference of 2015 in Antwerp. Il est l'un des principaux experts en l'éducation des adultes en Europe. He highlights prison education in the whole of adult education and tells us more about how the European Commission supported prison education in the past. À l'avenir, nous avons l'intention de publier des bulletins d'information plus courts mais plus fréquents. So please follow us also in the future and give us your feedback. Ou envoie-nous un article que nous pourrions publier dans la newsletter. Enjoy the newsletter and see you soon again. A bientôt. Au revoir. Bye bye. Um, and prison education, like adult um, education generally in society, provides a second chance to learn and to, to get equipped with the qualifications and uh, competences that people need. Um, to, to be a really active member of society. And by that, I don't just mean the basics of reading and writing. Uh, I mean also numeracy and all the other types of um, literacy that people talk about today. So digital literacy, financial literacy, consumer literacy, signing up to a healthy lifestyle, um, active citizenship, all these things are, are vital aspects of, of competence and literacy and, and prison education in its field and adult learning in general and um, contribute very much to this, it seems to me.